hi and welcome to today's video today I'm here with palette, palette look number four using the Isadora quad I didn't do any look with this last year and says it in, in this year's panel palette so I thought it's good to do it do it now So I have my foundation and things on. Now I will use this eyeshadow primer by Lumine. And I will set that with this lighter and yellow shadow powder in this palette I'll take this brush and take that this brown just put it in the crease open it up this is a good blending color for the grey I'm going to take this brush and take the light color take this just, just to prepare a little bit I will use this color tattoo to make the silver show up a little bit more using this brush Do you watch some TV shows? I watch a lot of them. This year it will be a sad year because we will say goodbye this spring and they are Bones, Vampire Diaries and Pretty Little Liars. So it's a sad, a sad spring. It's been a long time since a show that I've been watching that that will say goodbye. So and three at the same time will be rough. We'll see if there will be some tears or not. And it it will be fun to see how they will end them. What they've chosen to end them. How they've chosen to end them. But that gives me time to choose new shows to watch because I'm very behind on on the new TV shows because the ones I'm following are older ones that keep getting new seasons so I don't have time for new shows because it gets too much to watch them all I also follow Grey's Anatomy Criminal Minds, Big Bang Theory, Supernatural, and many more. Or maybe a few more at the moment. So tell me in the comments which one you are watching. If there's someone that will say goodbye soon. It's interesting to know. So now you see I put on the color tattoo on the Bigger part of my lid. I think I'm happy now. So I will take this brush again and the light shade. I only do the this the side. 
blend a little bit so that it's even. Now we take this brush, a flat brush, and the light silver shade. And you will now have a little bit sneak peek. I uh, hit pan on this shade. That was my goal for the season. So I'm very happy about that. So take that and put over the color tattoo. Then I will take the, this eyeliner by L'Oreal and I need a closer mirror for this and I will use this as a base for the grey shadow so I put this on the outer part Take a brush, this one, I blend it out. I'm gonna take some more. some more now we'll take the quad again and the this lighter gray and then the darker so we we'll take the lighter of the darker ones well I think I think that's a gray the lighter is a silver I guess so dark gray Light the gray. I put that, like that to set the eyeliner a little bit. Taking this brush, I'm blending. Little bit. On the sides and the crease. Not easy to film a tutorial, so I hope it looks, I hope you can see well what I'm doing. Um, it's blending, blending, blending. Shaking it, so it looks kind of even. Kind of. After blending a lot, I take the silvery shade again, the one I hit pan on, apply that. And over the, the, the darker grey, so it don't disappear too much. And take the this that I'm using for the darker one, and take the darkest shade. Put it on the outer part. Take 
taking the angle brush blend more silver I think now time for the rest we'll do the lower lash line this liner brush now I take from this palette since I'm having it in my hand I take the brown and the nude and just put down the lower lash line and then the darker grey or the lightest grey And then the darkest grey, put it on the outer edge, blending it up a little bit. Blend it. Take away the, the fallout that I have on my face. I take the lighter shade, the silver, put it in the in the part. I think I will add one more layer of the grey of the silver. I'm panning it, it's good to use more layers. Now time for some eyeliner. First also on the top a little bit. And on the inner. To make my lashes look fuller, I'm doing up and under. I will do the lower with this shadow pencil by Elizabeth Mott. Brighten and I will do my brows with this Give Me Brow by Benefit. Then I will take the highlight palette by NYX, this big brush, flat. Take first the cream shade and blend. And then take the white. And the cream shade, oh, target, target cream, as a highlight under the brow, the brow, brow. Maybe a little bit as a inner eye highlight. I 
I take this brush and brush through my eyebrows. And dry down a little bit. Sometimes I fix the line with a eyebrow pen. Time now, time for mascara. I'm using this by Lumine True Mystic Volume. I like this mascara, but it's something wrong with the stopper, or like, yeah, I think so, because it's, it gets so much product on it. Now, if I scrape it off, it gets so much. And if I put put this straight from the up here. On my lashes, it, it gets really clumpy and messy, so I have to scrape it off. So I don't know why it's like that. If it's something wrong, or if it's supposed to be like that. Because I like the formula in the brush, it's that there's too much formula on the brush. Somehow, I need a closer mirror. Because now this is been used, I think maybe two months. So, so the product that I have to brush off on the edge is a, a lot less than it was when it was new. Then it, it was crazy a lot. So I don't know if the stopper is broken on this one. What it is? There's so much product. If I will show you again, I have to brush off on the sides. It's a lot. I have not had a foundation. I have not had a mascara that has been like this before. So I don't know if it's. Do you know if do you know any mascara that is like this and it's supposed to be like that? You have to scrape off a lot. And this is the black brown shade. It's not the blackest. So I like the, the brush and the formula, it works well on my lashes. I think I will repurchase this one once this is finished and try if just this one there was some error with it or if they are like this. So that's how my eye look looks like. I have also put on some lipstick. I'm using this Twist Up Matte Lips in Ruby Gem by Isadora. And a little bit on the middle, I'm using the Pure Red by Lumina. Just in the middle to pattern it up a little bit. I like this smoky grey silver, a little bit black. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you liked it. Tell me in the comments if you want to know something or what you thought about the video. Thank you for watching. I, I hope I see you next time. Bye!